SCAD, or spontaneous coronary artery dissection, is a type of heart attack. And it's not due to plaque buildup in the arteries. It typically ha happens in young people, particularly women. We don't really know the cause, although it is associated with certain uh, blood vessel abnormalities, giving birth, uh, extreme exercise, or excitement, or emotion. And so we have a registry set up to study SCAD with over 400 individuals as part of it. We're trying to better understand SCAD. So we're looking at lots of things, causes, what medications people were on, taking a deep history. And what we found is certain, a certain percentage of our SCAD patients seem to have a family history. They related a family member, sometimes a close family member, who had a heart attack at a young age or who had aneurysms. So we dug a little deeper and were able to identify that in fact um, at least five family pairs had a direct relative who we were able to confirm also had SCAD. And this is the first time that this familial relationship and probably a genetic uh, relationship has been identified in this condition. Patients who've been diagnosed with a coronary dissection um, or SCAD uh, one of the things they may want to think about and their doctor should be asking them about is family history, just like we ask any other patient who might have a heart attack. But in this case, it might be other family members who had a heart attack when they were young, in their 40s or 50s or younger, who had no risk factors, never smoked, never had, or a sudden death. And I think then that doctor might be able to better understand or maybe even refer to medical genetics. Um, to get a full family pedigree and understand if this is something that runs in the family. I think we're also collecting DNA from our SCAD patients and their parents so we can try to better understand with a greater degree of precision by doing whole exome sequencing of these DNA samples and see if there are any gene mutations that are common to one parent or both parents and the SCAD patient and that's actually in part how we found some of these individuals as we were talking to family members. They said, oh, my aunt or my sister had a heart attack. Maybe she had SCAD too. It wasn't diagnosed at that time.